Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, as part of Automation Framework Factory, I'm going to explain about Maven Dependency Scope. So let's get started. What exactly is this Maven Dependency Scope? As part of understanding the Selenium test automation frameworks better, we should have some basic knowledge about this Maven Dependency Scope, okay? We should have basic knowledge, guys. It's not compulsory for the creation of the frameworks from scratch or something, but we should have some general knowledge about what exactly is this Maven Dependency Scope. Let me practically explain this Maven Dependency Scope for you now. For that, I'll open this Eclipse ID. I'll take you to this sample Maven project, which is already created, which has this pom.xml file. I'll open this pom.xml file. In this pom.xml file, if you scroll down, in this dependency section, we have already copied the dependency tags for testng. If you clearly observe the dependency tags for testng, there is a sub tag known as scope and it is referring to what? Test. What does it mean, guys? Okay, if you understand what this particular scope means and why it is uh, set to test, then you will be able to understand what is this Maven dependency scope. Fine. So, uh, why is this uh, scope of this uh, Maven dependency? X for test ng is set to test. Let me explain. So this means that the automation tests containing the test ng annotations, etc., should be created under the SRC test Java only, not under the SRC main Java. In real time, guys, when you work on some Selenium automation projects, you generally create the automation test cases that is uh, automated using Selenium automation tool, etc., under the SRC test Java, not under SRC main Java, right? So what will happen if you create the testng unit tests containing the Selenium automation code under the SRC main Java, what will happen? Let's try that, okay? Let's try that first, okay? Even though this particular scope is by default mentioned as test, but uh, still, if you go to SRC main Java and right click and create, let's say some package, say com.example, and under this package, I'll create a class, let's say, okay? Uh, test class uh, or test one or whatever it is, okay? And uh, here I'll click on finish. So this particular test one class has been created under the SRC main Java. And I am trying to use the unit tests, test and unit tests under the SRC main Java. How to create the unit tests under this uh, test one? How to create? I have to say at the rate test. So at the rate test is an annotation which will convert a normal method into the unit test, test ng unit test in test ng, right? So if I say public void test one method or something, sample method, if I hold the mouse on at the rate test, you see I'm not getting an option to import this at the rate test. It's not allowing me to import this at the rate test. What is the reason? The reason is same guys. If you go to the form.xml file, here scope is set to what? Test, okay? Here the scope is, Set to test. That's the that's the thing, guys. Okay, you cannot use this at the rate test annotation that belongs to this test ng under the SRC main Java under SRC test Java only. You can use. That's what it is saying. But still, if you want to use, you have to you have to change this test to compile. Okay, and save it. Now hold the mouse, hold the uh, mouse on at the rate test, save the project, and hold the mouse on at the rate test. You will get this. Earlier it was not coming, now it's coming because the scope has been changed for this Maven dependency tags for test ng from test to compile. That's what is the scope case, okay? So, but in real time, we generally stick to this uh, uh, scope of this test ng to test only, not uh, compile. And we generally not create such kind of uh, test ng unit test under the SRC main Java. Rather, uh, this uh, test ng unit test will be created under the SRC test Java only, okay? Simply I will move it here, okay? I'll not be creating this uh, automation test under the SRC main Java. But this session is all about uh, explaining you uh, what exactly is this, uh, sorry, what exactly is this scope, Maven dependency scope, okay? Why it is set to test in case of test chain. That's the main intention of explaining this session, guys. So, Hope you understood what is Maven dependency scope now. So that's it guys. Thank you. Bye.